Laura van de Sistam van Dick with the Music Store in Utrecht, The Netherlands. And today we are taking a look at this super cool Hafner H500-163 artist violin bass, which obviously is ultra iconic thanks to a little known bass player uh, known as Sir Paul McCartney, which uh, he played in a little band, uh, which you may or may not know, called The Beatles back in the 1960s. And um, yeah, this bass really changed music forever. And this is a really cool, faithful recreation of like the first Hofner violin bass that Paul McCartney played uh, back in the early 1960s. Um, this one is also made in Germany, so you really get the full part with this one. And um, yeah, it is just pure beetle goodness. So let's get into the specs. We've got a hollow body uh, spruce maple construction. And you can definitely feel that this is a hollow body because it is incredibly light. Just, um, I believe that it is uh, around two and a half kilos, which is uh, a little bit over five pounds. So again, incredibly light. So the top is made out of spruce and then the back and sides are made out of flame maple. We can also tell that we've got some multiply binding going on around the top as well as on the back. We've got the two Hafner staple pickups. We've got a floating bridge made out of ebony, um, which you can also then adjust in height. And I think that you can also move the saddles if you'd like, because you've like these four individual slots. So I think that you can then take out one saddle and then move it like back a slot, um, if that is what you uh, need for your intonation. We've got a trapeze tailpiece, got this really cool faux mother of pearl pickguard uh, as well as on the control plate also got that same type of material as for the controls we've got two volume controls so for each of the Hafner pickups then we've got a rhythm and a solo switch which um, rhythm is more kind of dark sounding and more, and more low end heavy and bass heavy and then a solo is a little bit more bitey and a little bit more bright then we've got a bass switch and a treble switch and so these actually also work as an on and off switch for the whole bass because if you have them both turned off then you get no sound at all so if you have the switches uh, like set towards the lettering then these are off so if you have the bass and the treble off the whole bass is off and if you have them both on or one of them on then you get sound so um, that's kind of like your tone control right there then you've got your input jack over here Got a maple neck with a rosewood fingerboard, kind of a narrow feeling neck, uh, but very much consistent as for the uh, width. So uh, it really feels as wide here as it feels over here. And then as for the profile, really just a C profile, nicely rounded. And this almost comes like a jazz bass feel uh, slash territory. So if you like a jazz bass, then this uh, will probably feel rather familiar. Again, we've got the rosewood fingerboard with mother of pearl dot inlays. We've got no dot side markers on the side of the fingerboard, which um, is uh, kind of uncommon to see, but indeed actually accurate to the 1963 version of this base. We've also actually got a zero fret. Then we've got this multi-layer nut going on and then the Hafner logo silk screen on the face of the headstock. And then on the back, we've also got this, let's see, a genuine Hafner original decal slash sticker, which again tells you that this base was indeed made in Germany, just like the originals were. And then we also got a volute, and then we've got these two on the side tuners with the really cool white tips. Also comes with a hard show case. So yeah, all in all, this base is just pure Beatle mania, really gets you those classic Beatle tones from the early 19th from the early 1960 tunes um, that uh, really took the world by storm so yeah if you're a big Beatle fan or a big Paul McCartney fan then you really need to have this one in your collection so let's hear what it sounds like but first if you're interested in this Hafner 500-163 artist violin bass be sure to head over to the links in the description for further details, if you enjoyed this demo, be sure to like the video and to subscribe to the channel for more cool weekly demos of cool bass guitars like this, or cool electric guitars, acoustic guitars, amplifiers, even all of that really cool stuff. 
Also be sure to like us and to follow us on socials, Instagram and Facebook. Links are also in the description. With all that being said, let's see what is Hafner 500-163 artist violin bass. Sounds like we're going to be playing it through the 1966 Fender Super Reverb. Going to just turn up the bass and turn down the treble and the middle EQ controls so that it is more suited to bass playing. So let's get to that part and take this really, really cool Beatle bass for a spin. Thank mm -hmm. you. 